guys so I just got home from school it is Wednesday and right now seriously every time I start a video y'all gotta go to the bathroom be right back actually I can walk and talk but um anyways it is a special week because donors choose is doing a promotion right now well it's right so for every teacher that doesn't have a donors choose right now, if you sign up this week and you post a project, then they automatically give you $50 towards your project. And that is like a big deal because sometimes it takes a lot just to get it started. And then once it's started, like random people will fund it. So if you can get $50 right away, that's a great deal. I had to fix my ponytail, give a little volume because I look like a boy. But anyways, I've done so many donor shoes projects um, for a bunch of random stuff. I got, I just recently got um, some like wobble stools for my classroom and some yoga balls that the kids can sit on. Um, I've done tons of book projects, like where I got different books, um, supplies. I got um, two Kindles on there one time, like a long time ago. Those are like not in anymore, but they were. Uh, what else did I get on there? I got some like math manipulatives and I got a lot of STEM stuff like STEM bin toys and um, stuff like that. So I'm going to post a new project today just to show you guys how easy it is to post a project because sometimes I like tell people at school about it and they're like, oh, I don't have time or I, I just don't want to do that and go through all that. But it is so easy. So I just want to show you guys real quick while I make a new project. Um, the project that I'm going to make is for a STEM club because I want to start like an after school STEM club. Right now in my class I do um, STEM stuff here and there, but I want to get more into like the robotics because we do not have like a technology or anything like that for specials. So I want to order some new little robots and maybe some other stuff like that. So stay tuned. All right, can I go back in there now and get to work? You guys good? You good? All right, come on. Come on. Alright, I'm back at my computer, ready to start my project. I went to donorschoes.org and I don't know what the home page would look like if you don't have one, but something like this, okay? So there's some of the projects I did in the past and um, it kind of tells you like the status of them. I need to make a thank you package for them. So right here I'm going to click create a project and then it says welcome what type of project would you like to create you can do a professional development one like if you want to go to the ron clark academy or um something like that i don't really know what else oh like get your teach on stuff like that um would be right there but i'm just going to do a standard project let's go um about your students mine are in third grade and i have this year i don't have as many so i'm going to put um, 25 because that's how many I have this year and then it says describe your students and the best part about all of this is it stays in here so once you do this the first time it all just stays there so I can just press save and continue and then this is the part that is fun it's the shopping so these are all donors choose approved websites or like I don't know people they work with so I have really only done Amazon honestly but a lot of these other things could be awesome. I'm going to click Amazon because I get everything from Amazon. So it just tells you that it has to be Prime eligible and you can't do Apple devices or refurbished items, which I don't think this is true because I know some of my friends have gotten iPads. So I'm not sure about this one, but start shopping. All right, so this comes up. I already know what I want, so I'm just going to type them in. I'm looking to get like the little Furio, is that how you say it? I don't know. Mini robots. Let's see what comes up. Yep, okay. So this is what I want. I think, yeah. That's what I want. So I'm gonna click it. Ooh, they have different colors. Okay, so I definitely want a blue one. Okay, why did it do that? Um, maybe I'll just get three different colors. I feel like that would be a good limit. One tip I have is make your project under $200 because I just feel like it gets funded quicker. But, um, ooh, like little holding cases. Okay, well, I probably need that, right? Three of those. 
because Lord knows those would be everywhere. Okay, so once you have everything you want in your cart, you just hit this button right here, submit items for approval, and then it gives you some encouragement because you're doing great, tells you um, what everything is and the price, and then they also have like a few things in here, so like third party shipping fees and just a few things like fulfillment and labor because they do like thank you packages and stuff. So the total for this project would be 257 which is a lot, but I'm just gonna go for it because I really want these for my STEM club. And then at the bottom here it just says, help me give my students, and it's literally, it can be one sentence. So I'm just gonna type, help me give my students um, fun new technology um, to learn with, oh, two more words. Okay, this year. Perfect. It says nice. Okay, save and continue. Then this is where you just title your project um, and then give 100 words minimum about it. So it's super, super easy. So I'm going to do this real quick and then I will show you guys what I wrote. Okay, so I just did robots on the run because I didn't really know what else to do. And then down here, I just said, um, basically, I would love to have these not only in my classroom, but also for STEM club. Um, we don't have technology as a special or anything, so this would be some of the only technology that they get during the day, like outside of Chromebooks and stuff. So then I'm going to scoot down here, and let's see. I think this would be under, like, applied learning, maybe? No. Or extracurricular. Let's do that because it's mostly for STEM club. Okay, and then it basically shows you, so this you might have to do too if it's your first time, but I just put that there recently and kind of lays it all out for you, shows you what people would be buying, and that's it. You literally just click submit my project. Boom. You did it. And then you can share it via email or on Facebook, but right now let's see what my project looks like. Perfect, so at the top it has like a little goal and $258 is what we're looking for. But um, yeah, I hope it goes well. So then once it gets funded, so like these ones are all ones that got funded. Um, let's see. Then you just have to submit a thank you project which is so easy. You upload six photos of the kids using it. This is like 200 words just saying thank you and what you're gonna use it for. And then sometimes you have to mail thank you notes to donors choose so they can like send it. But a lot of the times, like for mine right now, that one needs thank you notes, which I already sent. It's just they're waiting to receive them. But let's see, which one? Like this one. Yeah, it just says in this rare case, you don't have to send thank yous, but a lot of my projects have said this. So you don't always have to send thank yous. Also, if you sign up for an account and then you help one more person create an account, you get $25 towards your project when they get $50 towards their project, like if they're a new teacher. So I'm going to copy this code here and let's see. Gosh, I got too many tabs open. <laughs> yep, looking for stuff for um, Rock Your School. There it is. Okay, so projects. Let's see. Robots on the run. So I want to give $25. Mm, I'm not really sure how to put that in. Oh, apply a gift card or promo code. Maybe apply. And then perfect, it just takes it right off. Place your donation. No thank you. Yay, okay, so now my project already has um, $25 towards it. Okay, so now it's posted, it was that easy, and usually I share it to like Facebook and some of my friends and family will donate, but I've kind of posted a lot on there lately, so I might not post this one and just see what happens. Um, but STEM Club hopefully will start in September, so let's hope that someone gets on there and makes a donation. Um, if you guys want to start one before the 24th, because that's when the deadline is for the $50 added to your account, I'm going to put my little referral link down here so it benefits you and it benefits me. 
and if you have any other questions you can comment them or message me or anything you want because I seriously think Donors Truths is great and um, I will have so many more projects posted soon. <laughs> so good luck!